This is a poem called In Between It Is England Style. I'm watching a tree trunk buried in a wire fence. No arms, no legs, just a brown trunk torso skewered in the middle of a cold steel trespasses will be prosecuted or persecuted white wire. It's not something new to my eyes, it's not something I haven't seen before, but like in all those other times I can think of, it seems like I'm always studying the same question. How does it happen like that? I mean, how does it come to be? Because it's not just jammed in, pushed in, wedged in. It's more like it's sewn in, jellied in, grown in and living in. Like a skin tissue grown back in and over, stitched up lips that resist it. In no hurting, in no, in no feeling, though. Just, just integrating, just assimilating in between it is England style. I resisted too once. A month before this me by me photo, the time we get hauled off the street, dragged in the station on suspicion. I've got small limbs, bitten up fingers and skinny bone. The police have got steel toed authority, blue bottle armor plating and leather glove hands that coulda woulda snap a throat snap shut like styrofoam. The station is just the same, a mirror of their bodies, whitewashed, paramilitary, unassailable. I'm made to stand in front of them, six men coated and covered in Queen's law and silver studs. Just me alone, my white body sent away, left untouched. They lean back lazily on swiveling chairs, gangsters in a Hollywood movie. Radios crackling, lean back against walls, against metal cabinets, against desks, gliding their truncheon gaze up and down my body, caressingly. And then, Calmly, rationally, reasonably, a voice says, Right, take your clothes off. I bring my eyes up to theirs in a flash, afraid for sure, but resisting like I told you. I said, take them off. The voice screams to violation and violence this time. It says in the language of in between it is, Take them off or we'll rip them off for you, you half coon, black bastard. I'm being bilingual and I hear the translation. I drop my eyes down slow and peel off my jacket, my shirt, while they laugh and they snigger like hungry schoolboys in an overseas tech sex store, craving the exotic, salivating like Pavlov's dogs at the promise of forcing me naked, at the promise of raping my psyche. Ain't no hurting though, ain't no feeling though, just, just integrating, just assimilating in between at these England styles. I swear to myself, I ain't going no further than my underpants. I swear to God, I ain't going no further. I take my shoes off, my socks off, and then my pants. And after every piece of clothing, I stop. Yeah. Like I'm pleading with them silently not to make me go any further. But it's like after every piece of clothing that comes off, it makes them hungry. Like they want more, like they need more. And then I'm down to my underpants. Off! By now... More uniforms stand in the doorway of the room, one with a clipboard in her hand. Her eyes linger on my body, smiling, shaking her hands and her head in a mock disapproval at the boys having fun. My teen knees touching each other, underpants at my feet, my hands covering my skinny teen cock and balls, and then I scream, bastards, bastards, fucking bastards. I'm screaming real free now. I'm ordered to dress but refuse. All I'm studying is how to get outside. So I run out through the doors and out on the street. I scream naked how I'm evidence, how my body is witness to what fucking people they are, to what fucking animals they are. And it's how the world is gonna see me now. It's how the world is gonna witness me now. It's how the world is gonna help me now. But in my, in my mother country nights, outside is like inside. An unrealness about it all. Streets without people, Fog without fog, drizzle without drizzle, an unrealness in me numbness. And it's like, it's like I sense nothing, like I feel nothing, even in my screaming. Don't feel them when they come for me, their hands on me, pinning me. Don't feel my body refusing removal. Don't feel them smashing down on me, feet, me hands, mangling up my flesh with the steel-toed caps, jamming me up through police van doors like I'm tree trunk fencing and each time missing. Each time taking more of my skin out from me, back, me toes, me hands, me ass, until I'm pushed in, rammed in, wedged in, and driven off, dropped off at my mama's feet. And when I do feel, 
when I do feel you. It's, it's, it's not the coming out from the cataleptic that I sunk into. It's not even the wrongness of it all, the corruption of it all. What I do feel is, is seeing my mama's face, seeing her baby beaten in like this, mashed in like this, grown in and living in like this. But ain't no real hurting no more. Ain't no real bleeding no just just integrating, just assimilating in between the teeth. England style. 